Hi everybody, it's Martin the Flicking Feathers again today and I'm tying another really good wet fly to the tractor pattern. This is the Fee and Spider. As always, I'll put a materials list in the description along with a link to the Patreon page for anyone that wants to support the channel and get access to the members only content as well as being entered into the giveaways. So put my hook in my vise, it's a size 10, competition heavyweight, B175, something like that. And I'll get my thread started. I'm doing a nice base and back and then back up. The tail I have here 16 strands of Globrite number 11. I'm just going to square the ends. But better. Catch them in. Obviously, if you're tying a 12, you'll reduce the reduce the tail size a wee bit. Maybe down to 12 strands, something like that. Trim that off so it's about the length of the body. Then I'm ready for my rib, which is oval silver tinsel. Small or medium, um, it's sort of personal preference really. On this size for the for a, again for a twelve, definitely a small. But if you're tying a ten, you might want to go medium, up to yourself. So for the rear half of the body, I've just got another four strands of glow bright number eleven. I'm just going to wind this on. Down to the tail, and then I'll come back up. And then I'll tie that off. Nice and secure. To move away the waste. Now I need to change threads. To black. I'm going to take this back. So that the body's got to be 50-50 black and chartreuse. The front half is black sulfur. You could use SLF or you could even use a wee sort of sparkly like ice dubbing or something like that, glister. But I just like the, the plain black. Get that started. A bit more, just a wee spot. I like this front half to be fairly built up, and then come up with your rib. A full turn at the back, and then come forward four or five turns should get you up the body sweep everything back and make a full turn at the front cross your thread tie all that down trim away my waist I'm ready for my hackle which is a black hen and it's really big right um, you want the, the fibres to be like 
basically the length of the hook, right, they should be coming back into the tail. Just going to strip away the waist at the bottom. And I'll tape, separate out the tip roughly where the feathers fibres start to shorten. Right, I don't want these wee short fibres. Fold that back. Come in and trim that away. Now fold and wind your hackle. One turn in front of the other. Now we've got to use all of this. I like plenty of uh, plenty of hackle in this fly. Folding it back as I wind. But there actually, that's good. A couple of turns will just come in, strip that away. Fold it back. Tie everything down. And you can see there you've got quite a good black, heavy, soft hackle, but a lot of movement and the colours just shining through. Um, and you could finish the fly like this uh, if you want, but I'm going to add some jungle cock, which I don't think is in the original dressing actually, but I think it sets this fly off quite nicely. There's a split there. I'm just using a larger split feather um, rather than two individual small feathers. Just um, we've got to encourage the split so the feathers can sort of tie in nice and separate. Fold the eyes over the side. Two or three wraps, have a wee look. You've got wax in the thread. Tie them down, fold that back. Just come in, trim it away nice and close, then tidy up your head. That looks no bad. A wee fibre there that I just don't like. Just, just coat that with the thread just so that the head's nice and clean for the varnish. I mean, wouldn't make any difference from, from a fishing point of view but if you don't clean those wee bumps and that you end up with a really ugly looking head when the varnish goes on so that's it whip finish support the hook and then a wee oops Three coat of varnish, you can add two if you like, I don't bother for a fish and fly. And there is the fee and spider. So I hope that was useful. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please uh, subscribe to the channel and give me a thumbs up below. Take lines guys. Bye.